What is going on guys, Frosty HD here and welcome back to another video. In today's video I'll be bringing you guys episode 3 of my Rocket League trading series in which I trade my up from a player's choice crate to the mainframe black market decal. If this is the first episode you've seen, go back and watch the other two, I will put a link in the description below so you guys can see what I started off with and what I have now. But before this video starts I'd just like to announce that we are inching closer and closer to 200 subscribers. So if you haven't already, please subscribe, hit that like button, share this channel around if you enjoy it. But apart from that, just get straight into this first trade. To start things off, I got rid of my labyrinth for a white endo, three elevations and a pair of triplex wheels. I took this deal as people are currently picking up white endos for around four keys, which means I've made a key profit. Moving on to this next insane trade, this guy really really wanted parallax and said he would overpay by a lot and he delivered. He gave me a streamline which is around 3 to 4 key profit so I was really happy with this trade. Moving on from that trade, this guy gave me a hex for my endo. I instantly took this deal as I'll be making 1 key profit. At this point I knew I could make quite a bit of profit with white endos so I picked this one up for 3 keys, some mixed crates and a forest green virtual wave. Next up this guy was after a bunch of uncommon items so when I put mine in he just put a bunch of crates in there and I instantly took this offer. Moving on, I did a risky trade and decided to pick up a pair of grey Guardian Draco wheels. I know that the price value of these Dracos is around 4 to 5 keys, so I was hopefully trying to find that person who would give 5. In this trade, I simply just flipped a Samurai for a breakout. The only reason I took this offer is that the breakout has a higher demand compared to the Samurai. Back with another endo trade, this guy literally just flipped it for 4 keys, which obviously, again, is 1 key profit, so I 100% took this deal. Continuing on to the next trade, I flipped the streamline which only picked up for a parallax for 8 keys. I still can't believe how much profit I made from that trade. Next, I finally found a buyer who was willing to pay 5 keys for my Draco, so I instantly took this offer. Moving on to the second last trade of the episode, I simply just flipped Hex for 4 keys, but he, he wasn't budging, so I added a few crates just to seal the deal. This is the last trade of the episode guys and I'm just going to let this one play out for you. So there you guys have it, the series is completed. I've traded my way up from a PCC crate all the way to this beautiful mainframe decal. If you guys enjoyed this series and want to see it again, then please smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. But apart from that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.